Hey, what's up guys, this is Guillermo Auto. I'm doing a left front driver visor on a Honda CRV in 2013. It can also be used for a 2012 and 2014 as well. I'll put the part number at the end of the video. So basically I got my new one here. Um, these are a little different. This one has a connector because it has a light on it. Uh, they're not held in by screws or clips. Well, I guess you can call this a clip. It's, a, it's kind of like a plastic lock. And uh, basically where it's located is on the back of this uh, near the windshield. And so basically when you go to take this out, you'll put a flathead up here and push on the lock and then spin the visor and then it'll come out. Here's the lock, what I mean. And uh, so basically you get something like a flathead or something like, you know, thin like that, that's kind of strong. And you push down on the lock part and it's more towards the side of the rear view mirror. Um, but you don't want to you don't want to go too far or else you'll miss the lock and then you push it down and while you're pushing it down you you uh, turn this visor towards the windshield so get your flathead in there push it down move this towards the windshield and then you should hear it kind of click or unlock and then you could uh, wiggle it out and then you uh, disconnect this white connector so here's what I mean I got it off I'm trying to sh show you a better uh, view you push that lock down and then you spin the um, visor itself and then it'll become loose like this so it'll become unlocked and then that's when you could loop, pull it down um, and then uh, when it's locked in when you put it in it's locked in it, it, it goes tight so here's as a connector after you get it out we go and reconnect your connector run the wire back up there a little bit your new visor has to be in the unlocked position before you try to put it up so make sure you do the, the unlock on that. And then uh, you put it up, you, you line that little pillar up in the hole in the ceiling there, and then you just run this in. And then you'll twist it back towards the windshield and it'll lock in place. You'll hear it click and then you're good to go. And that's it. So uh, hope this video helped you out. Please like, comment, subscribe. Thanks for watching, I'll see you next video.